everyone. Love and respect. Ezekiel and Ariel. It's your grandma, Roxanne. And your and mom. Your mommy. <laughs> birthday today, Ezekiel and Ariel. Your mom's birthday is four days before your yep, birthday. Because you were scheduled to be delivered on my birthday, but I had the flu, so they couldn't give me any anesthesia. And I had to wait till the flu was gone, so I didn't have respiratory complications during delivering you and then you came four days later so that's the story behind that <laughs> yeah ask your father eric brown to tell you the truth about the week you were born it was yes. absolutely amazing me your father eric brown and your mom had an amazing divine intervention experience getting you here safely and alive you came here with so much love wanted desperately we saw you on the ultrasound a week before when your mom labored for a full week mm -hmm. we saw you in the ultrasound with your little fists up like this ready to fight ready to come out right? <laughs> <laughs> okay and is and ariel you've been nothing but a blessing and a joy in our lives it's been two birthdays now that we don't know where you are you were taken on october on june 8 2010 in a public mob assault by your father and his uh, crazy, greedy, awful abuse. And we know you're being very abused by Sandra Sullivan and her mother, Diane Kearney and Linwood Kearney. And we've been focusing on the corruption in our city that allows that with Mayor Michael Nutter that's allowing the cover-up because they're related to them and it has to do with money in the city of Philadelphia and so on. But what we are going to do now, we are going to front, we're going to use our pri Greenwich family private investigation all of our resources and continue fundraising to pay private investigators to find where your father and Sandra Sullivan are because they're federal fugitives in the U.S. District Court docket and they're City of Philadelphia criminal fugitives for the public mob assault. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to invoke that law for where the uh, Children's uh, Fugitive Act, when one parent deprives another parent of uh, the other parents seeing the child uh, and there's not a permanent custody order and that's exactly what happened that day. We had just served Judge Kevin M. Doherty's June 8th rule to show cause on June 17th in uh, accommodation of your mother's uh, emergency petition modified custody from May 26th and May 27th. All the crimes and abuses in the federal docket since uh, December 13th that Sandra Sullivan was recorded beating you while she was in the commission of SSI fraud, bigamy, and perjury, and all the crimes that your father did, going down to Georgia and lying to the U.S. Um, lying to the Georgia Superior Court to get a fraudulent divorce, then marrying Sandra, lying about his uh, mechanics earnings on the street, his income, drinking and drugging, cop and drugs with you guys in the car, a million things, criminal things have been done while you guys have suffered horribly including uh, his mother being um, your uh, paternal grandmother, Pamela Kendrick, being very much involved with this um, uh, Church of Christ at River Road mm -hmm. in Albany, Georgia, that's involved with an African exchange program, and you may or may not have been taken out of the country. There's so many crimes that have been going on. We're going to first find, use our private investigators to find Sandra Sullivan and Eric Brown which, by the way, we have some proof that on, uh, I think it was the 13th, Eric Brown or someone has stolen, some, has used uh, one of our prior addresses where we all live together and function as a business. Eric Brown has stole that business, versus an easy recovery print that your uh, mother and he worked on supposedly to help you have a, a future and then higher lyrics invested all the money and supplies for, 12-step recovery printing and conventions and so on. He has stolen that to produce, to register a mechanic shop business. And now they've taken a, um, they've set up a green dot account on an uh, on a address, that address 2368 North Van Pelt Street to, def to continue defrauding Social Security and Department of Public Welfare. And that investigator, green dot, called me because they stole my address and they stole my Skype phone number, which is published all over the internet. All right, so they took those things, they put them together and then they committed more identity theft, fraud, of several agencies. But we're going to get them on the, we're going to find you guys first where you are, and we're going to get the courts on our side by filing the uh, Federal Fugitive Task Force why they, you should be retrieved from them, and he should lose 
and he already has lost custody of you, but we have to enact that officially through law enforcement now and requires finding you first. And that's what we're going to do. We love you so much, Ezekiel and Ariel. And um, I would just like to say to both uh, Ezekiel and Ariel, a.k.a. Kubi and Fat Pants, uh, I don't know what you're being told about me, about your mother. Just know that whatever you're being told, I love you very much. I never abandoned you. I never left you by choice. I'm not on drugs. I'm not a bad person. I'm not dead. I'm here. I'm alive. And I'm living every day in the hopes that I will see you again. I will not ever forget you. I will not ever stop breathing for you. I miss you with all my heart. I love you so much. The two of you are such a huge part of me and my life, even though you're not here. And I'm, go I'm doing everything I can to get myself in order, to have everything I need to show you that, you're, that I fought for you. And I was fighting to make it for you. When I lost, when, when you were taken from me, it was, the, I didn't think I was going to make it. And I didn't know I would even have the strength to be alive today. But I just want you to know that I'm, I'm proud of myself, that I made it through. I'm proud of you guys for making it through. And just keep making it. I will find you. We will be reunited. I am not the person you are being told I am. But you I'm need to know here. that Sandra Sullivan is an evil, demonic thing. And everyone in her family, Grace Sullivan on Facebook, has been notified that their Magilla Gorilla thug criminal family are going to all be subpoenaed. Darren Sullivan, Andrew Sullivan, Laquita Sullivan, Grace Sullivan, Pamela Kendricks in Albany, Georgia, Willie Kendricks, Willie in, Albany, Kendricks in Albany, Georgia, and Regina in Atlanta and Albany, Georgia, are all aiding, abetting and also Benny criminals. Frank Brown. Yes, and you are and actually um, exacerbating the trauma separation injuries, the theft of heritage, and the horrible stuttering to, syndrome that we saw already inflicted on Ezekiel from the trauma you already did to him. To Ezekiel and Ariel, you need to understand, I know you can't right now, but if these people whose names were just mentioned, if they loved you and they really cared about your best interest, they would not have made it their mission to rob you of your heritage and everything that you are. They would not have done this to you. This is a great, great travesty that is taking place. You are being robbed of more than you are able to understand right now. Your your heritage, who you are. There is nothing like. Can I just say this to Pamela Kendricks and Willie Kendricks and the pastor, Reverend Clemens of the Church of Christ at River Road in Albany, Georgia, who married Lorraine Greenwich to Eric Brown on August third. Pastor Clemens. Pamela Kendricks, Willie Ken, don't you should never use the word Christian again, and you certainly shouldn't defile Christianity and other real Christians, authentic Christians, by calling yourself a Christian. You should burn in hell with the other demons that have caused this horrible, evil infection upon our society and injured our family. How could you do this to Ezekiel and Ariel? Your own flesh and blood. And you, you all turn them over you, to these criminals, Sandra Sullivan, who beat them, who just wanted them for money. She's a criminal. She's evil, and her family is nothing but thugs. If you could have seen them, and you are aiding and abetting, and you're actually helping this. All right, don't call yourself a Christian, Pamela Kendricks. And I'm going to see my. I'm going to do my best to get you criminally prosecuted. But first, we're going to focus on Eric Brown. Sandra Sullivan, Diane Kearney, Lenwood Kearney. There is a new civil rights movement. See my shirt? There's a new civil rights movement. Families fight back, say no more DHS demonic horror stories. We're not leaving it up to the agencies anymore that are financially driven. DHS slaughtered families do vote. Too many people fought and died so you could vote. Vote, vote, vote. Cross party lines, send a clear message. Unethical elected officials are removed. In Philadelphia, that means no second term nutter, no second term nutter, no second term nutter. 
God bless everyone. This is Roxanne Greenwich and Lorraine Greenwich. We love you, Ezekiel. I love you, sweetheart. God bless.